The A's are averaging 10.3 runs per game during their four-game winning streak where Chris Davis has five home runs. Photo by USA Today Sports The A's are averaging 10.3 runs per game during their four-game winning streak where Chris Davis has five home runs. Photo by USA Today Sports There is a pitcher's duel by the Bay a night after an 18-inning marathon and Chris Davis and the A's bats try to stay hot in Texas. We break down the odds for those matchups and much more, plus give our best bets in MLB Daily Line Drive. Double play pick Colorado Rockies at San Francisco Giants, minus 116, 7 at FanDuel, we get treated to nice little pitchers duel as the Rockies and Giants continue their four-game set in San Francisco. The Giants have taken the first two games where there has been a total of just six runs scored. That includes last night's 18-inning marathon, in which San Francisco pulled out a 3-2 victory and it could be more of the same today as Kyle Freeland will tow the rubber against Madison Bumgarner. Freeland got touched up by the Braves last time out, resulting in his ugly era, but a deeper dive into his numbers show he has been better than that. The young lefty still has a 1.26 whip and an opponent batting average of .188. So, if Freeland cuts down on the walks, he has issued eight in his past two starts, he should be fine, especially against this Giants lineup. San Francisco ranks 28th in runs per game, batting average, home runs and dead last in ops this season. On the other side, Bumgarner just continues to do his thing. Despite not having his best stuff last time out, he still has a nice 3.32 area and an impressive 0.95 whip. And he faces a Rockies lineup that has almost been as bad as the Giants, ranking 25th in average, 27th in runs per game, 28th in ops and 29th in home runs. Most of the damage done versus Bumgarner has been with the long ball. Mix in some tired legs and an early start, there is no reason to think this one will exceed the total even one this low. Pick, under 7 the A's bats are smoking hot once again, and none hotter than that of Chris Davis. Davis has launched 5 balls into orbit over his last 3 games to bring his total to 10 already for the season. That's a pace for something like 90 home runs this year. 90. Davis and the A's will look to stay hot when they continue their 3 game set tonight in against the Rangers in Texas. Like we said, Davis isn't the only one crushing it. The A's are averaging 10.3 runs per game during their four-game winning streak and today, they are Adrian Sampson's problem. The 27-year-old right-hander has been solid in two long relief appearances this year but is making his first start of the season. Last September he made five appearance for Texas, four starts, which included giving up three runs on four hits to A's in 0.1 innings of work. He'll then have to hand the ball to a Rangers bullpen that ranks 25th in opponent batting average and has given up 11 dingers, third most in the bigs. Marco Estrada gets the ball for the A's, who despite getting touched up last time out against Baltimore, has put up some solid numbers his first year in Oakland. He owns a nice 1.13 whip with an opponent batting average of .225. Estrada has mostly been hurt by the home run, so if he can limit the Rangers though the A's should win and at a good price. Pick, Athletics minus 104 yesterday's picks, 2-0 season to date, 1-5, 1 want, even, more, free, MLB, picks. CWHO Hour covers experts are on today. Streaking and slumping starters streaking Blake Snell, Tampa Bay Rays 2-1, 2.84 era, $100, after being rudely welcomed to the season by the Astros, Snell has looked like his Cy Young self since. The lefty has allowed just one run on eight hits while striking out 24 in 13 innings over his last two starts. Today, Snell will try to keep it going against the Blue Jays today in Toronto, a team he dominated last season. Snell made three starts against the Jays last season, pitching to a 0.54 era and a 0.72 whip while racking up 27 punchouts. If you're looking to bet this game, consider the Rays' run line. 
slumping Rick Porcello, Boston Red Sox, 0-2, 13.50 RF minus $262, much has been made of the Red Sox's struggles in the starting rotation and Porcello might be the worst of the bunch at this point. The former Cy Young Award winner has allowed over half of the batters he has faced to reach base over his first two starts, resulting in a god-awful 3.14 whip. Porcello will try to get back on track as he takes the mound today against the lowly Baltimore Orioles. The Red Sox are currently minus 250 home favorites with a total sitting at 11. Weather Watch 3 strikes O's know the Baltimore Orioles are regressing to form after a solid start to the season, at least for them. The Orioles have dropped 8 of their last 9 ball games, losing those contests by an average of 5.4 runs per game. However, Baltimore has a little value today as big 225 road dogs today in Boston getting to go up against our slumping starter, Rick Porcello. Homer's unfortunate ODDESY Homer Bailey starts for the Royals today and boy, we sure hope he wins. For his sake. Bailey's teams are 1-21 in his last 22 starts dating back to last season and his first two start in Kansas City haven't shown much more promise. The poor guy has pitched to a 9.00 era and a 1.70 whip in his first two starts for the Royals. If his slide ends it will come against Cleveland, where the Indians are slight minus 112 road faves. A road warrior getting traded to the Astros in August of 2017 revitalized Justin Verlander's career. And while he's has been great for the Astros, he has been truly outstanding on the road. The Astros have won 17 of Verlander's 20 road starts, with him pitching to a 2.26 area and a 0.96 whip in the process. He will be a hefty minus 190 road favorite tonight in Seattle. Saturday's top consensus if you or someone you know has a gambling problem and wants help, call 1-800-GAMBLER-21. NJ only. Odds may vary. Eligibility restrictions apply. See website for details.